four kids. Cracked for Kids. Hi again. Welcome back to Cracked for Kids. Today we're going to read the letters you sent in asking about some cool jobs and get to meet the awesome people that do them. Let's go to the mail room. All right. Our first letter is from Amy, who writes, Dear Katie, my dad's a lawyer. Should I be one too? Great question, Amy. Lawyers are important people in our society. They go into courtrooms and make sure that bad people go to jail. I'm here with Liz Manigan, a real live lawyer from New York City. Liz, I hear your job is to argue with people. Is that fun? Well, I work in corporate law, so I've never actually been inside of a courtroom. Oh. Well, what is it that you do then? Discovery work. That sounds like fun. What does that mean? Well, in a corporate case, the opposing side will give me literally billions of documents that I have to pour through looking for important facts. So, it's sort of like a game? So it's sort of like paperwork, every day for 12 hours a day for years on end. But, I mean, the pay's pretty good if you don't go to a bad school. What schools are the bad schools? <laughs> pretty much anyone you can get into. Alright, let's move on to our next letter. <laughs> this letter's from Duncan. He writes, I love playing video games. Can I do that as a job? It might sound crazy, but yes, you can actually get paid to play video games. And Tim Mazzaros does it every single day. It sounds awesome! Well, we can't just play the games. We have to, like, look for bugs. Like tickle bugs? No. You're basically trying to find, like, the least fun parts of the games, and then you play those over and over. So, you, you do get to play the video games before they come out? Um, uh, kinda, yeah. I mean, there's this one, like, mostly broken beat game that we've been playing all the time. I think it's ruining my vision. So I went to this doctor. So what like, do you, you like school. about your job, Tim? Let's just move on. Nora writes, should I be a mortician? Why are you guys, ro stop rolling the tape. Can you stop rolling the tape? This is awful. Oh, this one isn't bad at all. Sean writes, I want to own an ice cream shop. It's great, Sean. Small business owners are an important part of our community. They help out their neighbors every day. So, Earl, you own your own ice cream shop, is that right? It sure is, Catherine. In fact, I've been feeding the good people of Dunbar ice cream for pretty near 40 years now. Owning an ice cream shop must be great. Yeah, yeah, it is great. Except, well, the last few years with this economy. No, Earl! Ice cream is wonderful, Earl. but but you know they opened up that mega mall down there at the town center. There's a cold stone in there. Boy, when that happened, all the... All the little shops on Main Street just started mm -hmm. going out of business. Now, well, the bank is telling me that they can't give me any more extensions on my mortgage. Of course Sometimes can't. I just wish my my dear sweet Betty, God rest her soul, of she was a she's smart dead. woman. Now Betty'd know what to do, but life is hard. Yeah, hey. Earl. Life, life is hard. Hard. <laughs> Don't give you a rule book. Yeah. You know, nobody no. tells you make a bad decision. <laughs> Or you can end up going to hell in a handbag. the kids. Uh, not sure how to get out of it either. Who won't the Republic is safe? I'm so high. 